own pad. He got the speed run. Ryan got the speed run. Tony Romo got the um, long pass. So I'm going with Tony Romo, man. You know what I'm saying? No, I'm just going to auction this car out, man. No, I'm, I'm just going to. I'm just gonna auction this car out. It's a gold though. But Tony Romo's a gold, but I ain't do nothing with Tony Romo. Nope. His awareness is 71. His is 67. Now I'm going to promote him to the starter, Kyle Wilson. I'm going to promote him to the starter. Three more wins, make it to the playoffs, baby. Let's check our starting lineup. Baby, you good.
Welcome in, everyone. I'm your host, Larry Ridley, and this is Madden Ultimate Team on EA Sports. Come on, mission two, man. Tilt here in week four between the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and the man, Detroit Lions. The Bucs enter this new season not just with playoff aspirations. I'm on a mission. mission. Win three straight games. If everything breaks right. But first, they've been handed a tough assignment here on the road right out of the gate. So let's go now to Tampa, Florida, with Jim and Phil on the call. The Buccaneers come out in a jumbo set. Cruz had it, but couldn't hold on as this goes incomplete. Taking a look at the offense now, always one of the best coming out of the slot, and that is wide receiver Victor Cruz. Yeah, he's just one of the best wide receivers in the NFL. How about that? Undrafted out of UMass, and what a job he has done here in the NFL. Stocker mm. has the football. That out route that time was run to perfection by the receiver. He made such a sharp cut. He gets, gets himself some space from the defender, and the quarterback puts the football right on target, just short of that first down ball. Third down and three. Stacy. There you go. Five. Wow. The Buccaneers will go for it here on fourth down and a short yardage situation. Let's go, baby. It's early in the game. It's fourth and short. You go for it and it doesn't work. That is an emotional lift for the defense. What a statement made by them. Great starting field position for the offense. First down at the 29. Wide to the left. It's wide open. Touchdown. Breaks the long one for the touchdown. And the early momentum in their favor as that touchdown puts them in front here in the first. Oh, I love that word, momentum. The big bow. If big bow is on their side, that is a great thing to have and a good feeling as a football team. Wow. Oh, he actually misses the point after. Field goal. <laughs> it at the two and starts his return and he's taken down right at about the 29 not quite to the 30 the Buccaneers really let it all hang out the last time they had the ball filled and went for it a fourth down in their own territory let's see if they're a little more conservative with this possession now, you know it's amazing I want to say really a good defensive call by the defensive coordinator but let's be honest when you're backed up and you go for it on fourth down situation situation like that anybody could have made that call so just a bad bad decision on the offensive side if there was a beat writer covering this coach what do you think the headline would be tomorrow in his story? It'd probably be the first time I've ever agreed with the beat writer. And he's thrown to the ground. Man, this defensive end, Jim, he is some talent. That time, good job, makes the move, shows the speed, and gets around there and gets the sack. The Buccaneers take it from the 23. And it's swatted away midway through the first and with that stop this offense will be in excellent position to extend the lead yeah it's going their way right now it is jim and so you got to take advantage of it the game always has ebbs and flows and right now uh, momentum is on your side go out there and make a play the buccaneers will risk it here going for it on fourth down the buccaneers take it from the 23 the Buccaneers turn the ball over on downs. The Buccaneers that time go for it on fourth down, and they fail. I did not understand the decision, but you got to make sure your team doesn't get down from that. you got to keep them up. What a place to start for the offense. Robos lined up. Two tight end set. Thompson's there to make the stop. 
Amari Cooper caught a ton of passes in Alabama and was the first wide receiver taken in the 2015 draft. He's ready to come in and play right away in the NFL. He's smooth. He knows how to run routes. And he was the man in Alabama. And that's what you want in your number one receiver. Second down and five. Here's the handoff and no running. Thompson's going to make the tackle. Jim, the defense gives up the first down that time inside the red zone. But there's only so many things the offense can do. Let's see if they can hold him. First down and 10. Right back to the ground. Good stop. He's going to be swallowed up behind the line. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. Okay. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. It's now second down. They bring in the extra tight end. Cooper's there. Catch the ball that had a lot of heat on it. Coming up to the line at the four. Touchdown. And it's a touchdown. Late in the first quarter, and they're stretching their lead out. It looks like they have it in their minds to put this game away early. Well, that's what they're trying to do, isn't it? They just want to get it over with early. Just put all doubt, re just remove all doubt, I should say, from the opponents that you're in for a rough day, and you might as well just give up. Add the extra point. The kick is good. Everyone's lined up for this kickoff. Makes the catch at the seven. Able to move past the 20 and brought down at the 23. The Lions defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. They'll go nickel. Looking long. Could have been intercepted. Let's set the lineup for the defense. The former defensive MVP of the league. One of the true game changers on defense. reception today third, third and short, and short following, following the completion, the, completion. The, Buccaneers the Buccaneers break puddle and show a jumbo look it's a game of six Stacy's able to get it done that time why because he has the power and the will to make it happen. Third and short, he just gets it done for sheer willpower. And now here's Stacy on the toss. Picked up a couple that time. The Buccaneers still possess the football as we begin the second quarter. Second down after going to the ground game, the first play. The Lions come out in a dime package. And Calvin Johnson can't hold on that time. That's a wonderful job that time by the secondary. Everybody's in position. Nowhere for the quarterback to throw the football. And it leads to another incomplete pass. Third and seven coming up. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. The Buccaneers will take the snap from the 40. Inception. 
That was an awesome job by the defense. They just read the quarterback's eyes. They got in position, and they made the interception.